Russia is set to deliver four Project 11356 frigates to India, with the first scheduled to arrive later this month. These advanced warships will be equipped with BrahMos supersonic missiles, marking a significant milestone in the ongoing defense collaboration between India and Russia. Developed through an Indo-Russian joint venture established in the mid-1990s, the BrahMos missile system has become a cornerstone of India's military capabilities, including the upcoming Integrated Rocket Force. It has also attracted international interest from countries such as the Philippines, Vietnam, and Brazil. So, in today's video, we'll explore the BrahMos cruise missile, its development, operational capabilities, and the broader implications of this Indo-Russian partnership. Let's dive in. The BrahMos is a medium-range, ramjet-powered supersonic cruise missile capable of being launched from various platforms, including submarines, ships, fighter aircraft, and mobile launchers. Also designated as PJ-10, it emerged from a joint venture established in the late 1990s between India's Defense Research and Development Organization and Russia's NPO Rocket Design Bureau leading to the creation of BrahMos Aerospace. The missile's name, BrahMos, is derived from the Brahmaputra River in India and the Moscow River in Russia, symbolizing the collaboration between the two nations. First test fired in 2001 in a vertical launch configuration, the BrahMos underwent successful testing and development before officially entering service with the Indian Armed Forces in 2006. Since then, it has become a key asset in India's defense arsenal and will soon play a crucial role in the country's integrated rocket force. The BrahMos PJ-10 achieves supersonic speeds between Mach 2.0 and Mach 2.8, depending on the cruising altitude, which ranges from 10 meters to 15,000 meters. This speed not only makes it difficult to intercept, but also enhances its strike power. The missile's stealth technology further reduces its radar visibility, improving its chances of reaching the target undetected. The BrahMos is equipped with an inertial navigation system for maritime targets and a combined INS-GPS for land targets. Terminal guidance is achieved through an active-passive radar system, which ensures accuracy with a circular error probable of 1 to 10 meters. The missile's range varies between 300 to 500 kilometers, depending on the variant and launch platform. It is powered by a solid propellant booster motor for initial thrust and a liquid-fueled ramjet sustainer motor for maintaining supersonic crews. Its dimensions differ slightly depending on the launch platform. The ship and ground-launched versions are 8.2 meters in length, with a body diameter of 0.67 meters, a 300-kilogram payload, and a launch weight of 3,000 kilograms. The air-launched variant is 8 meters long, with a 200-kilogram payload and a launch weight of 2,200 to 2,500 kilograms. All versions feature four mid-body clipped tip delta wings and four smaller delta control fins at the rear, providing stability and control during flight. The missile can be armed with a 200 or 300 kilogram high explosive semi armor piercing warhead or a 250 kilogram sub munitions warhead, offering versatility in its destructive capabilities. As we already mentioned, the BrahMos can be launched from various platforms, including vertical launch systems, ramp launchers, or from the air. In a demonstration of its versatility, the missile was successfully launched from a submerged barge in 2013 proving its capability for deployment from future missile submarines. As of September 2024, the BrahMos missile family includes several variants. The BrahMos A, designed for air launches. The BrahMos NG, next generation, a lighter and more compact version currently under development. And the BrahMos II, a hypersonic version that is still in the pipeline. The BrahMos II is expected to reach speeds beyond Mach 5, making it a true hypersonic missile. It will be powered by a scramjet engine, replacing the ramjet used in earlier versions, 
and will utilize a specially developed fuel to achieve these extreme speeds, significantly enhancing its strike capabilities. As 21st century global dynamics evolve, India finds itself navigating an unstable international landscape where neither a unipolar world dominated by the US nor a bipolar order centered on US-China rivalry aligns with its strategic interests. Instead, India favors a multipolar world with a strategically relevant Russian presence to enhance its geopolitical positioning. The BrahMos missile project is a key example of this evolving partnership, reinforcing defense ties between India and Russia. What's more, India now leverages its advanced BrahMos technology to expand its influence through defense exports. The recent delivery of BrahMos missiles to the Philippines, India's most significant defense export deal to date, illustrates New Delhi's broader strategy to strengthen defense relationships with Southeast Asian nations and assert its role in regional security. What do you think? Let's discuss in the comments below. And if you found this video informative, make sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for the latest defense news and analyses.